Okay, first part. I don't promise that any of these are necessarily the only way of doing them, but they are one way of doing them. I've got this line. I'll start with the left-hand side and eventually get to the right-hand side. I've got just one fraction here, so I've got two terms here. I'm going to link them together, so I need them both to be over sine theta to start with. So minus this got to be over sine theta. So I have to times the bottom, which is one, by sine theta. So that'll be sine squared theta, and that'll be one minus sine squared theta over sine theta, and that is the same as cos squared theta over sine theta, which is, I've at least got a cos theta on top, I've got tan theta on the bottom, so I need to get a tan theta here. So I'm going to get cos theta times by cos theta over sine theta, which is the same as cos theta, dividing it by sine theta over cos theta, because when you divide by a fraction, you times by its reciprocal. And so this equals cos theta divided by tan theta, which I can write down as cos theta divided by tan theta. Probably other ways, but that's my way. This one here, I've got 1 minus sine theta over cos theta. And I want it to end up being 1 plus sine theta. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have that fraction, and I'm going to multiply through both sides by 1 plus sine theta. Or top and bottom. So I'm start, again I'm starting with the left hand side and I'm going to eventually hope to get to this bit here. But I've seen a 1 minus sine theta, I want the 1 plus sine theta so I'm going to introduce it by timesing top and bottom by that. And that will give me uh, 1 minus sine squared theta on top. So it's 1 plus sine theta minus sine theta and they will just disappear. And on the bottom bit I'll have cos theta times by 1 plus sine theta. And 1 minus sine squared theta is cos squared theta. And that's cos squared theta over cos theta times 1 plus sine theta. Cos theta will cancel out with one of these ones here. And so that will leave me with cos theta over 1 plus sine theta. And that's what I wanted. Well, that's what I wanted there. Part C, I'm going to do it in red because I'm going to get a bit lost where I am. I've got 1 plus 1 over tan theta plus tan theta. And this one here, I've got no tan theta within here whatsoever. So I've got sines and cosines. So I'm actually going to get rid of my tan thetas. So 1 over tan theta is a reciprocal of tan theta. And tan theta is sine theta over cos theta. So 1 over tan theta, well that should be cos theta over sine theta. And then I'm going to add tan theta, which is sine theta over cos theta. Again, I wanted to have just one expression, so I'm going to put them together. So I'm going to have want them both to be over sine theta cos theta. So this one here, I have to times the bottom by cos theta, so I need to times the top by cos theta, so that will become cos squared theta. And now I've got to times the cos theta by sine theta to get sine theta cos theta, so I need to have plus, and I need to times top by sine theta, so that will be sine squared theta. And I've got cos squared theta plus sine squared theta is 1 over sine theta cos theta and that's what I wanted. Now part D, I'm doing green. So D, I've got 1 minus 2 sine squared theta over cos theta plus sine theta and what I'm going to do here I think is actually replace the 1 and replace 1 by being sine squared theta plus cos squared theta and then minus 2 sine squared theta and that's all over cos theta plus sine theta and that now leaves me with uh, sine squared theta minus 2 as minus sine squared theta oh, well I've got cos squared theta so I've got cos squared theta minus sine squared theta all over cos theta plus sine theta and that's a, on top it's a difference of two squares so it's cos theta minus sine theta 
times by cos theta plus sine theta and that's all over cos theta plus sine theta and now obviously the cos theta plus sine theta cancels out with this one up here and so that just equals at the end cos theta minus sine theta and that's what it wanted to be so that's correct and that was because that cos theta plus sine theta cancels out with that cos theta plus sine theta to leave just one so cos theta minus sine theta over one which is cos theta minus sine theta there may well be other methods of doing that but it's done